What's up, guys? Today, we're going to do a little analytic. <laughs> Is it in English? Analyze. We're analyze. We're, we're, going going to analyze. <laughs> we're going to analyze Mega Avalanche 2017 here with guinea pig here, Laurent. Because he raced, I wasn't there. I just watched uh, some pictures. Well, I don't care. I took your room in your fucking fat bath, fat, fat, <laughs> fat house. <laughs> so it was nice. Then he had to do. He had to do the race for me because I was uh, in the pond meeting, riding with Santa Cruz. Then couldn't make the race. Then, as you can see, uh, George Weisland up front. Right Weisland one two zero one, and we have guinea pig just in the back of Josh. I'm like, don't go behind Josh. You ready? Yeah, you told me to to leave, leave a gap. Leave a gap. There we go. Start from just all shot. I think almost. They like to obviously you don't have the power of Josh Bryslin, been writing for four years, you know. You cannot expect to learn everything in a couple of videos, but definitely pretty good. <laughs> that guy almost did shit here because here in the beginning it's just like so many, many corners and look no at this. No it, grip. It's no grip, it's just like big boulder of big rocks. Look like Josh is over there, still in the front. Papa Cafe and Thibault. Now here on the right here, we just have Kafi, just the guy in front of... Uh, two, two, two other Camembert Brigade. Yeah, they're part of the Camembert Brigade. They're the people who watch my video. <laughs> <laughs> he, he got the, the salon in his balls. <laughs> we, we have to say, they're around 50 years old too. Then that's pretty good to keep up with some people of 20 something years old. Just wait until the end of the video when you're <laughs> going to see my crash. <laughs> okay, I basically told him to chill out. It's qualification and it's going to be some big guys at the front. Just don't stay in the front with them at the gate. Just step back a little bit, let them fight and just find a guy who can have the same well, space. The you. objective we, we decided is uh, I wanted to do like last year, first line of Challenger, uh, of challenger. So I have to be between 36 and 39. Okay, right exactly. now I count, I'm, I'm in the top 20. Yeah, because you have to count when you're like him, like this, to make sure you can go first row of the challenger. Then uh, all this part is just like, you have to make sure you find someone who right like you, just try to grab his wheel and just to have a, a clean race before the snow part. Here, the important thing is choose your line and go for it. Take a foot off, yeah. just to let the bike play. The most important thing is to don't try to crash there because, I mean, you're going to land on your hand, you're going to have wet gloves, and it's going to be a start to be pain in the ass. Just try to climb, don't try to run, climb easy with your uh, with your pace. Don't don't try to follow some people, like maybe the guy on the right is like already riding, or this guy will just pass you. That's what I felt when uh, Clements uh, passed me in Reunion Island. And, well, uh, that, that's also where the, the difference is where I didn't follow all the exercises. Oh, Jérôme is back. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> because I was already out of breath, not enough intervals like you told me to do in the yeah. CG Fun Camp. That's why the CG Fun Camps are good for CedricGracia.com. <laughs> Go check it out if you want to. <laughs> you know those climbs. To, to not, uh, okay, this is the to don't die. <laughs> to, uh, technical report, to don't die. Those sprints are good for those little climbs, sharp climbs, to make sure that people don't pass you. And after you have to survive, because, uh, you know, like when you do sprints like we did on the video, you will recover a lot faster. If not, you will basically uh, play with the red zone all the way to the finish. As you can see, it's kind of one uh, one tr uh, one line here. Yeah. Papa Cafe in front. Papa Cafe is on the front. We're going to make it a little bit faster because this is boring here, just like pedaling, pedaling, pedaling. Here, you have to try to find a, a good wheel to chase, but I mean, don't burn all your all your all your energy yeah. here because uh, the race is still really long, and we need to enter a technical station here with a lot of switchback. Like every year, we do the same semi-final kind of. Yeah, a lot of people used to cut here. Yeah, I didn't know the first year, but I really, really easy to find out when I look back at the guy I was smoking was just behind me. Another mistake I make here, and I remember you pick your grip first. Yeah. <laughs> because I was stuck on top of the border. Yeah. And uh, that's also in the CG from camp where you, you say, don't uh, think ahead. Think ahead, don't show up with the wrong, uh, wrong gear into a climb because obviously it's going to be a lot harder to climb or you have to get out of the bike and actually push. Then, uh, yeah, you don't want that, especially right now in this condition of the race, you know, like uh, the, 
the, the race spread apart a little bit and you now it's going to be time to chase uh, the guys in front or like I say try to find a good wheel stay with him and make your way your, your way uh, yeah, into, the, again, into the gap I need the control I want it to be 36 between 36 to 39 then it's even harder because you have to come like when I race I don't want to have uh, anyone in front of me <laughs> yeah well I counted the guy who passed me and I was around 30 I thought I was around 30 okay here technical part as you can see really easy to have a puncture because sharp sharp rocks obviously now you're a little bit tired oh good line there hey yeah good job well you make a corner we can go straight but uh, you know when you're tired you right. pay less attention uh, you basically uh, I was thinking about, 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 about that? Yeah, but <laughs> I was also not thinking about my breathing and trying to ventilate that you yeah. another, <laughs> another cut here what did I say about Meg Avalanche before you left don't go don't try to be 19 on 20 point or 20 on 20 point in each section you're never going to be able to do it then it's better to be 15 on 20 points all the way down it will be a lot easier here you cannot see but it's really really sketchy and the bike is floating because it's so yeah. many rocks and don't forget the people in front of you sometimes they're as tires as you they're missing the light and throwing rocks in the middle of the line and you always have to go where um the dirt is a little bit more brown because that's where the the track is a little bit more clean. Be the size of the tire yeah, exactly it's not oh much. you see people start to have a problem now and here it's bumpy. I mean, it's it's, really it's a loose and it's a bike ride. It was a good line on the right, but it's a drop. Then uh, will we do that on the video? Because <laughs> <laughs> yeah, okay. Now important that drop. I almost had the flat tire warning because I launched that thing. I didn't do the practice. Uh, the practice. Then uh, yeah, really easy to make a mistake and have a flat tire. As you can see, uh, Josh did. Yeah. Where is Josh? <laughs> well, yeah, because he didn't, never he didn't he never passed the finish. <laughs> he went straight to his truck and picked his bike. His bike. Because because he had a flat day. A lot more switchback, as you can see, it's dusty, oh. it's dusty, and it's really hard to breathe. Watch, high my, watch my move. Watch, 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 watch. watch oh, hey, you saw the line, watch, yeah? Watch, watch, watch. Between those, one and two. Oh, oh what's sick, bro. Go, Proper go, job. Go, go, go. Oh, <laughs> he took the chance here because it was a lot of rocks and like kind of loose rocks. Too. That was his key, but I see, like you say, do or do not. Well, Commit. when you make this, when you make the commitment, just go for it. Don't try to be, oh, no, no, too late. No, just well, go. I, it's because I saw Papa Cafe is over there. I, so I said, okay, I got to pass those two guys to, to get back to them. Papa Cafe is uh, Gérard, basically the guy who hang out with me in the regional and Ed, who saved my life when I almost died bleeding to death. But then uh, Papa Cafe is on the front, he's a guy who likes to manage everything. And look like he's managing pretty good his race so far. You guys are teaming, uh, teaming to uh, well, being a team. I usually follow him when we ride with the Camembert my God. Yeah. You I was an inside line, but you missed it because no. you must focus on him. <laughs> yeah, I, the thing is, I didn't want to pass him. <laughs> and I usually take that thing on the right because that's an impossible turn. You can't. Uh, yeah, that, that, that's, that's, that's a line stupid. inside was actually a lot easier. Yeah. You see a lot of people on the side of the road. It's not because they're tired, it's because they have a flat tire. Or mechanical, or derailleur, or chain, whatever. We're going to have some switch back here. You see some mud path. This is good corners to recover because. From now on, it's going to be really challenging. It's going to be some pedaling here. It's, oh, one guy <laughs> was really on the over here. From now, it's going to be pedaling, pedaling, pedaling for quite a bit. It's a little climb, then oh, we, we speed up that part because yeah. it's boring. Ooh. So now we know what someone told us 32, another one told us 33. So it's hard to trust when yeah. you don't know those people. They want maybe uh, they want to fuck up yeah. your mind. Yeah, and sometimes they count the guys who had the flat and you know. Ah, true, 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 true. Because we saw a lot of people. Yeah. Those corners, I remember, are sketchy. This and then there's two corner. lines. Soon one up, one down. I think I took the big boy. Yeah. Because I knew I was gonna be on camera. With exactly. You, so. <laughs> Definitely, oh yeah, 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 you took the drop, uh, perfect, here, and after that, it's going to be a little bit flapped out back in the grass, if I remember good, yeah, long quarter, all speed. pen, <laughs> commitment, no finger on the brakes, because that's fast, that's, going that, fast, that's yeah. really fast here, and it's good, because you can recover, but sometimes, I would suggest to go off the, um, uh, to go a little bit on the grass, it's a lot yeah. smoother, instead of being on the because you actually, the, the tire marks that kind of, Making a, a yeah, and it's bad because a lot of people are breaking a, 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 a root, no, rot, yeah, rat, rat, no, like the rat, the, the, the rat. rat. <laughs> 
Okay, this is definitely this one is of the critical sections. This is all pedaling. That's why we speed him up because it's pedaling, pedaling, boring, pedaling, pedaling, pedaling. And you probably suffer here because you didn't oh. do too many uh, sprints. That's why the I'm sprints of one I'm minute, cooked. one minute are useful. That's why. And the big surprise is going to come soon. Okay, this is uh, definitely the last part of the race. It's uh, basically following the, the road and it's just like. Uh, Burn to jump, burn to jump, just following the run. Yeah, as you can Again, see. I was playing, I'm totally dead. But I know this is flat out, I gotta go really fast, and those jumps are just stupid. They, I learned a lot on the. I mean, they're too the short flat. for the speed you got. And you see those poles in the. Yeah, those poles, the wood pole on the left wasn't so nice either. <laughs> true. True, that, that, this one as well. <laughs> you see, they put a rub, like right, orange rub. And another rub there, just to people to don't cut the, the track, to don't do the French line, basically. Well, this is good, it's fun, but when you're that tired, all of a sudden, it's just like complicated. Be careful that drop, I land so flat warning. Oh yeah, like this. <laughs> Couple jump with no landing, but the good thing is, you're firing the road, you know, like, you're like, like what? Like yeah, two, this one I'm going left. Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, <laughs> launching to flat. Well, I mean, committed. Yeah, they make a kind of a chicane all the way. Oh, they make the chicane there, yeah. Because otherwise you go way too fast. Are you checking on the back if, some, if people are going too fast, you're not? Well, I see one guy behind and soon, soon uh, my crash is going to happen. Uh, uh, yeah, because he uh, just told you, but he crashed. <laughs> but you're going to see and we're going to learn what to do and not to do. <laughs> Into a condition like this, when you cooked, you're close to the finish, you want to qualify. But as well, you're dead. You're dead. Oh. And there's a mechanical, oh, someone waiting for someone, oh, maybe someone doing like you, trying to count the people. To count the people, yeah. This is actually quite flat here, we're entering soon Alpe d'Huez. Oh, you took the jump right on. Sick, proper sick. <laughs> well, I got the technicity Not too now. bad, yeah, look that guy. Oh, oh that guy was sending you the yeah. number. So, so now I know I'm 35. You're right. 35, then you're good, you're just one way to go though. Yeah. And just have one guy in the back. Here's the easiest part, look at white, flat, flat, in the grass, one easy. Oh, right now! And look then, at the time, <laughs> now he's 38. And we are going what? Okay, listen look, now. Oh. Dude, look, he's starting with his hand back backward. What the fuck, <laughs> brother? <laughs> Trying to fix his brake, he didn't even realize. <laughs> he didn't even realize <laughs> it's upside down. And, oh, I, man. I just located my shoulder and I got a big hit on my head, I was just out of it. Look, I'm running You're backwards. You're doing pretty good! <laughs> Dude, this has to be the best thing I've ever seen. He's riding sweats. He's doing kicks up. Next time, try to ride like this, it'll be easier. Because you yeah, might be in the front right <laughs> with the wrong, the wrong way. You're riding English style. Oh my god. And, and I stop because look at my right hand. I, I, my shoulder is can short. Hold yeah, his shoulder was dislocated too. And now I stop the camera, but... Uh, hey, just <laughs> applaud it, man. Beautiful. Never seen this before in my life. What do you want to do in this situation? Obviously, he didn't see the crash coming. Someone hit him from the right right mm -hmm. inside. Then each... Uh, this record is, is uh, shorter. Get up. He don't know what happened. He's, <laughs> he just get up. His shoulder is down. Fix his shoulder. Grab no, his no, bike. No, I didn't fix it. I fixed oh, it. Oh, you more. fix after. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Grab so. the bike. Everything is upside down. Oh, my livers went down because he didn't realize his his, uh, his handlebar did one full lap. Then uh, try to think. Basically, when you grab your uh, your bike, try to breathe because shit like this, you're going to make it even worse. Because you're going to ride like this, you're going to realize, oh, I can manage to finish the race like this, but no, you're going to ride like a total. Well, even not like this, but even with something wrong, you're going to stop again, right? You're going to stop again. So not, it's not something is wrong. Well. It's yeah. better to take a little bit more time to put everything back together, fix the brakes, boom, boom. Always, uh, little tip I do, never over tight um, some of your parts on the bike, especially mm -hmm. under underbars, maybe the, the gear, um, uh, the, the gears and uh, the, um, the brake slivers. Mm -hmm. Like this, when you crash, they bend or they drop, but like this, you can fix it with a little tap, you oh, will yeah. fix them back. If not, then we snap when you brake, then we snap. We do this in motocross, in True. MTB. Mm -hmm. If not, you will break the parts and uh, or you will try to fix, but it's so hard to fix because you're not, you're knackered and you have to ride maybe with your levels <laughs> like this and like then you're, you're not going to do it anywhere. 
Well, it's not an excuse, but I do ride with my levers kind of vertical. So yeah. if it's this way or this well, way, I don't change too much. <laughs> but, but yeah, this is exactly not what to do. And uh, even, I mean, it was stupid to try to go back with the shoulder. I, I've, well, I've dislocated my shoulder before, I know. You made my day. <laughs> when I saw that video, because obviously my friends for the brigade, the Camembert Brigade, they sent me this. It's like, I think we have a new, uh, we have a new team member, part of the Camembert Brigade. <laughs> And Very you're strong. definitely the king. <laughs> and send me the video. I'm like, do you think this is normal, Cedric? He starts to ride like this. And you see, he's riding upside down. Boom. All of a sudden, all the brakes are the wrong way. Nothing is working. The stamp, <laughs> the stamp is upside down. It looks like you're turning like this. You're not turning like this. Yeah, even, even if I wanted to do it on purpose, I couldn't do two meters. I don't know how I did this. but uh, <laughs> I wish I was there just to watch it because this, this make my day. I, I hope you guys are laughing as much as I do because it probably happened to you as well. Well, It happened to me, but I figured out it was the wrong way because I had the lefty. Because I couldn't turn, I couldn't turn. Yeah, but you didn't yeah. do like 50 minutes. <laughs> That's proper sake. Well, if you guys uh, enjoyed that, I definitely did. But the tip well, is slow down, put it together, put it, think, think, breathe, tries, <laughs> put your tongue three times in the mouth, and be like, all right, what I'm doing now? Just fix everything. Even if the, I know those guys are passing you, but hey, at the end of the day. Well, That's way it is. To, to finish on the positive note, compared to last year where I did uh, hit the, the finish you know, for the first time in the front line of, uh, of the Challenger race, I was flat out. It was kind of luck. This year, I was totally in control. I was not going... I was totally going at my speed. Uh, you were definitely you. not a passenger. You look more fit because you were breathing hard, but in this high altitude, everyone will breathe hard. Well, at the beginning, I had the ventilation thing, but at yeah. the end, uh, yeah. <laughs> after the But beginning. the good okay. thing is, you could follow Jérôme uh, from the Camembert team, and that's pretty good. It was a good uh, little rabbit for you because uh, it looked like you were following him. He's done it like 15 times. Oh, yeah, yeah. oh, he did, he did, yeah, he did. He did a lot, a, a lot of them. Then I'm pretty surprised I mean that crash was pretty ridiculous. Let's be let's be honest. One kilometer but to the finish one line. Kilometer, one kilometer. place. I mean, well, that's why because <laughs> here maybe your cable was touching. <laughs> the eyes was like this because you was cooked and tired and you wanted to make uh, the cut. But something uh, good to learn from that. You improved big time. I guess the CG fan camp online worked because uh, those those uh, those sprints help. You could have done a little bit more like this, maybe you will avoid that crash, maybe those one minutes, you know, those pain in the ass one minute um, uh, kind of sprint yeah, have to be done. The pedaling is not... The not pedaling... Uh, well, it's hard to pedal I mean, but no, I, I know. It's, it's more like the repetition of how yeah. many times you do the hard pedaling. It's not like one time, twice, okay, you can take it even mentally, even, even if it's not prepared, you can take one, two or three sprints by taking 10 to 15 of them. Like from each corner, a sprint to get mm -hmm. back uh, to speed. Yes, that's why the training is important, and that's why uh, you like you think those guys are a lot stronger than you. Of course, obviously, yeah, they're professional and they train for that, and they do sprints at home. And they're younger. And they're younger. Then when you're 50, I mean, shit like this happen. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm getting there. I'm 39. Maybe you will see a video of me. When you'll catch up to me, you won't see what happens. Yeah, because he just told me when you're 40, basically one year is double. Then, yeah. Uh, yeah, okay. Well, it's going to be hard for drinking and training then. It's going to be tough. But, you know, <laughs> trust his coaching. It works. Shedrigacia.com. Yeah, you know, it was pretty good. I'm glad, I'm glad he's, he's my guinea pig. You know, he's my little project, even if, uh, I mean, he's... I my didn't get, project. Uh, yeah, exactly. <laughs> I didn't get the youngest in the field, but I wanted to make... Uh, um, uh, more for everyone and uh, it was too easy to get 18 years old you know 18 years old it's really easy you uh, you will do he will do everything you say because you think you're god then he don't think I, I i'm god but you know i'm here to help him and it looked pretty good except that crash maybe next step would be we should make a video about a learner cr yeah, the crash the, the crash i mean well, I, the guy hit me i, I didn't do anything wrong <laughs> well, well, i know but the one who's on the ground is you yeah the true. one who paid the bill is you true, true, you paid the true. bill today that guy get up faster and he's on the bottom yeah. straight right <laughs> and he qualified and he qualified on the front front line of the the challenger race well 
Guys, this video is basically to teach you like it's possible for everyone. CG Fun Cup Online and SellGrassier.com. You will learn all those little tips to make your writing easier and like faster and a lot safer. safer. <laughs> well, not here today, but uh, <laughs> well, well, you know when you got the little, the little monkey in your head sometimes. It's a race too. You know, <laughs> you, had, you had to face with your second you inside your mind. It's like, go flat out, go flat out. And all this was like, oh God, no, hit the brakes. <laughs> We all have those people in there. Like, go big, go big, you can do it. And other ones like, oh no, hold on the horses, brother. <laughs> hold on the horses. You know, you have the monkey losing the papers. Like, ah! You know, you have the monkey who is like basically piloting your head. Yeah, this guy, you know, like, bam, 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 brrr. <laughs> yeah, that's the monkey when he crashed was probably like, Try to look for the map. Where's the map? Where's the map? Where's the finish? I don't know. It's like, where's the monkey anyway? <laughs> Bananas everywhere. All gone. I'll see you later. Fuck it. He probably went to early day, just put in a hammock, hang out, just like deal with it. Well, that's it, boys. I hope you enjoyed the video. Get no. it big, did good. That was Alpha US 2017 qualification run. Tomorrow, stay tuned, boys. Tomorrow is going to be the race. Helmet cam from Flying Menge. You remember the guy from Reunion Island who saved my life? Now he got new eyes. He know where he's going. He got an operation that he know he can uh, judge the, uh, the distance. Sec second in Challenger. Yeah, second and in Challenger. First in Masters 50. I guess uh, CG Fun Cup Online is working yeah. because Menge been training hard and it look like now we... Yeah, he know how to do, <laughs> he know how to do the focus with his eye. Basically, he's not uh, looking something which straight he see 3Ds. Then uh, for him, now uh, it's difficult to get focused because he see women on the side and he actually see like he see the full thing before he just see like a paper. You know those papers in Christmas? You just they all flat. Yeah. Now he see 3Ds. Uh, then he see mountain. It's, it's not blind mange. We, we, we gotta find. Yeah, we have to find a new nickname. It's not flying uh, blind mange. It's uh, flying reborn mange. Yeah, it's reborn mange. He's fifty. Something too. Uh, he's yeah, well, he's 49. Not yeah, he's like him. No, no, he's, he, I'm not. I'm not 50 yet. He's over 50. Well, but you'll see tomorrow when you're 40 uh, something, 48, 50, <laughs> same shit. Then uh, yeah, stay tuned. Watch the race on Flying Mangate.